Let's talk about the differences between these two popular solubilizers, polysorbate 20 and polysorbate 80. You must have heard about them uh, before, or maybe this is your first time, or hearing about either of them or both of them. Polysorbates are oftentimes scary chemicals that people think it's scary, not, but not as scary as we think, because all things are chemical. What is a solubilizer? A solubilizer is basically what you had to oil, okay to make it mix with water okay that is the simplest term for a solubilizer now these two solubilizers are, are different in that this polysorbate 20 is used to solubilize fragrance oil or essential oil when we're talking about solubilization is the process of making your oil mixed with water okay this is a raw material that when added to oil make it mixed with water so polysorbate 20 is used when you want to mix your essential oil or fragrance oil with water so that's the job of that one now let's come to polysorbate 80 polysorbate 80 is uh, what i call the big sister of polysorbate 20 you can see the difference between them you can see the grade from 20 to 80 so they have the difference of 60 in them so this six, this 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 difference give this the upper hand to solubilize carrier oil so polysorbate 80 so let me take this aside so this is for essential oil polysorbate 20 is for essential oil or your fragrance oil polysorbate 80 okay the big sister of 20 is to solubilize your carrier oil so let's say you want to mix uh extra virgin olive oil or any other oil for that matter with water you will have to add systemic amount of polysorbate 80. So when you mix it with your carrier oil, when you add water to it, it will mix well. So these are the differences between these two, uh, these two solubilizers. And um, I can't go more than this. I don't think there's any other way to explain this to you. So when you see polysorbate 80, talk about carrier oil. Any of your carrier oil, you know, um, coconut oil, you know, babasu oil, and sweet almond oil, and so on and so forth. When you're talking about polysorbate 20, think about your carrier oils, okay? Like, uh, think about your essential oil, like lavender, tea tree, thyme, and so on and so forth. Or your fragrance oil, okay? So that is the difference between the two. If you have any question, okay, about these two, um, these two type of ingredients, let me know below. In our next video, I'm going to show you how to use polysorbate 80. And the upcoming video, we're going to use uh, polysorbate 80 in our project. So stay tuned for that. So in my previous video, I showed you how to use polysorbate 20. So now after this, I'm going to show you how to use polysorbate 80. So stay tuned for that. If you love this video, give it a thumbs up. Click the subscribe button and the notification icon to be notified of my next video. Thanks for watching.